How is one's character formed? Well, if you take a look at your mind, will and emotion as a collective whole, of which I call it the CPU, the character processing unit. So just think of your mind, will and emotion as a checkered board. And the pattern on the checkered board is actually determined by the day-to-day -day consistent decisions that we make. For example, if there's a requirement for you to do a quality job, this is a decision moment. And let's say if you choose not to do a quality job, despite the requirements, and your response is, I choose to do less since nobody is looking, nothing bad will happen. And you consistently display this decision pattern, not only for these circumstances, but in future circumstances to come. So what happens is every decision opportunity becomes a negative pattern. Every circumstances that present itself, you choose not to do a quality job. The next circumstances, you choose not to do a quality job. So your consistent choices then become a growing negative life pattern. And character is being developed, except that in this case it is bad character. And if you continue on in this negative life pattern, so to speak, you will experience stress. Stress in terms of your working relationship with others, stress in terms of quality problems that happen as a consequence of your choices. In any case, uh, a negative life pattern will always bring about uh, stress due to violation of character principles. On the other hand, if you consistently choose to do what is right, you have a positive growing life pattern. And that will put you in a good position to be forming a character of value. So every day before you sleep, your character is already formed. The question is, is it good character or bad character? So every decision opportunity gives you an opportunity to uh, establish a life pattern. And the more consistent your life pattern is, to values uh, which are higher than your self-interest, to that extent, your character will be good and of an excellent standard. Think about it. This is Joseph Tan here from goodmonday.com.